But before I joined the West Coast Eagles, I was a school kid like you guys. Um, I grew up in Fremantle, went to school down there. When I was in high school, I was year 12, and we were playing a game of basketball with our PE class. And in this game of basketball, it was competitive, as you can imagine, at year 12, we were playing pretty, pretty aggressive basketball, and uh, one of the PE female teachers was refereeing the game. And something happened in the game, and a couple of other guys disagreed with what the, the uh, teacher had called, and they started arguing with her. And they got quite aggressive towards the teacher um, in their language and in their body language. And I was one of the other players. And I was shocked initially. I'd never seen really a teacher be approached or spoken to by anyone, let alone another student like that before. And I stood there and didn't know what to think or didn't know what to do. But then, it didn't feel right to me. It didn't feel right that this teacher that I respected and that was there to help us be better, to learn, to grow, should be treated like that. So I stepped in between the students and the teacher and said that. Said that's not right, that's not the way we behave, that's not what we expect. And it calmed down. Oh, my adrenaline was pumping, I was nervous, I was sweating because I didn't know what was going to happen or how that would be perceived, but it felt right to me. And I know the teacher really respected that action. I didn't do it because I thought I was a leader. I did it because it's what I believed and my actions showed my beliefs. Was anyone else going to step in and help? I don't know. Maybe someone else would have if it went too much longer. Maybe another student would have said, I'm someone who can do something here. But in, in that instance, it was me who stood up and said, there's a few of us here, someone, somebody needs to do something. And I made sure that I was that person. Mm -hmm.